temperature. Out at a Pontiac Lake. Bike tool stand out here. A long time since I've been out to this one. Passed it by a few times going out to a Highland Recreation Area. We got some nice trails out there. Almost did it again today, but I haven't been here in so long. I, I'm guessing probably eight years or so since I've been out here. Get some good climbing in out here. From what I remember, pretty much be riding this blind as well since it's been so long. So if you just looked up Pontiac Lake and found this video or do most of my riding in Southeast Michigan here. And uh, just trying to document the trails. Now we got the gimbals. The stabilized footage makes it easier to watch. Yeah, hey, I'm trying to do a series of trail previews and then uh, I also do other fun videos, do some reviews, probably do some mechanical stuff. So if you care to see any of that stuff. Or just uh, more trail previews for Michigan and I'm gonna be doing more traveling and biking. Hit the subscribe button. Come along for the ride. Climbing right up the bat here. Just gradually kind of snaking up. Go downhill here. Whoa! Went a little high. Well, if you're from the area and you like mountain biking, chances are you've been out here. If you haven't, just do it. And I can say that even not remembering the trail all that well. a state park so if you have that recreation passport you should be able to get in season's winding down there's nobody out there today at the booth just replaced my drivetrain on here did one ride and an easier trail I have the eagle set up on here now Oh, this looks like an eagle climb here. Oh, yeah. That is a brutal climb. 
that's a lot more steep, technical than some of my other local stuff. <laughs> Got a lot of rocks, roots, slippery stuff out of here. Sometimes I look at this stuff and kind of laugh to myself. I wonder how beat up I got riding that 95 GT backwards all rigid. <laughs> Remember hitting all the bumps, not being able to see. Take advantage of your gain momentum out here. If you're a new rider, I really test the boundaries of the bike. Let go of those brakes. Ooh. Woo! As I hold on to the brakes down that thing. It's probably want to do that on some trails that you know. Ooh, nice job. Original plan to keep the speed in check. <laughs> I dropped right into some sand. second ride with the Eagle I was wondering if I was ever gonna use it after being fine with the one by 11 come out here here I am in it Here's equestrian trails you gotta look out for too. Kinda like uh, Addison Oaks. They're weaving in and out. So 
looks like they might have redone it here. And I just seen some red tape. They must have rerouted the trail. Thumbs up to the people who come out here and work on this stuff. Mostly everything in the area is very well maintained. Got a lot of people that love to ride. A lot of people who love to put in some work. I'm guilty of slacking on that myself. I used to work on the local trails just by myself a lot. It's just hard because I work weird hours. A lot of times they're doing trail work on the weekends and I'm working weekends. To donate some money though. The local trail system, the Kramer. Hell yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Hit the wrong line. <sighs> Easy or hard. Another sign that says easy. Go this way for the easy. went high on that one came wide on this didn't see that rock tried to cut in but since these trees are leaning lost it and then I just bit it right over here somewhere oh look at this I ain't the only one that bit it here you got a reflector sitting there uh, all right, I'm gonna do a little system check on myself and the bike. See where we're at. So after all that, the gimbal wasn't working anymore. And uh, I don't know, it decided to work after a few hours, but that, for that ride, it was done. <laughs> I don't blame it. I did have some phone footage that I recorded, but that is now sitting in the bottom of the Salt River with my old phone that I lost. If you're not following my videos, I lost a phone in Arizona on a kayaking trip, so I wasn't going to post the video, but that was pretty much two-thirds, if not more, of the trail, and everybody likes a good crash, so that's it. Hope you liked it. Remember, never underestimate the fake.